Sea Otter is an incredible event, but what is the best thing here? The only people we can ask are the punters themselves. Let's see what they love about Sea Otter 2023. I think you might be sitting on it, but what is the favorite bit of tech you've seen? Tech or a bike or some product that you've seen at Sea Otter this year? Favorite tech? That's a good question. Um, seen anything that struck you here to, uh, you know, at the, at the event? You know, um, was it Nog had a very, very cool system that you could place under your water bottle mount that was uh, an alarm that would notify your phone if somebody moved your bike. And they said that that may be a really good idea for something like this. So, yes. Well, that's a bit of a one-off, isn't it? it so, was, I mean, it's not, not super high-tech, or but, you know, it's a little bit high-tech, but something super useful. It was like $60, and you could keep your bike from getting stolen, and it would track it. So, you know. Love it. Thank you very much for your time. Love your style. Absolutely. May it long continue. Uh, just the kind of community. Everyone's all together. Uh, all the gravel racers, the roadies, all the mountain bikers, they're, we're all just together here. That's a good answer. I thought you were going to say a brand, but yeah, the <laughs> community, why not? Love it. Cheers, dude. Appreciate it. Thank you. What's been the thing, what's been the thing that struck you most at Sea Art? Your favorite either product or a bit of tech or anything like that? Bags. Any Bags. Bags. Yes, like for handlebar bags when you go out, when you go out like on a gravel ride or something like yeah. that the ability to have on hand right at your fingertips yeah. what, what what you actually need whether it be food whether it be you know or just the, the, the and then the versatility too because yeah, yeah. some of them you can actually mount your computer on top some of them are you know just colors bags yeah. you know i get the feeling though you're something of a bag fan I actually like it. Yeah, just give us a little spin. Look. Just spin around a second. Look at this thing here. Look, it's a see-through bag, a leather bag, well, just a regular carry bag. Yeah. yeah, so kind of modest as well. Yeah. Like it. You know what? I just love the event. The, the hot event, just seeing families and kids out getting out riding as a bike guy. Do I want you to be on a these bike? Sure. If you're riding a bike, I'm stoked for it. You know? Yeah. We've all been there and the Sea family, so I just love the fact that it brings all the disciplines together. Yeah. There's so much here, like uh, mind melt, and so all of it. I can't pick one thing. Good answer. Thanks. Right, I feel like I know what you're going to say here, but at Sea Otter, is there any tech that has particularly struck you? <laughs> Come on, show us what you've got in your hand. All right. Man. The company is called Snick. Um, we're an integrated GPS bike security technology. So right. if my bike moves at home right now in North Vancouver, I'll be notified. I can trigger an alert. The 50 closest people around the bike will be notified. Um, if I don't answer the notification because I'm sleeping, it'll call me. Um, it's much deeper than an air tag, you know, an air tag notifies the thief that they're being tracked, this yeah. and that. So yeah, it's uh it's the new standard in bike security. Love it, and that's this is it. This is it. Goes in the steer tube, nice and small. Yeah. You know, one time installation, it's in there. Um, and you're all set. Best tech at Sea Otter, there you go, you heard it here first. Is there one thing that's really struck your eye? Yeah, the uh the electric bikes are really a catch mm. for me right now because I'm really thinking about the transition a few years from now, especially because I like downhills and uh, yeah. climbing is getting harder and harder. So if I get one, I'll be glad about it. And I've seen a lot of good stuff here. Yeah. 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 E-bikes in a few years. E-bikes in a few years, maybe uh, four or five years, but because of the downhill mainly, uh, yeah. So that gives me my more mileage, you know. Matt Jones. Matt Jones? Is Matt, yeah. Matt Jones here? Yeah. I thought he was a dark vest. I did too. He told me that Matt Jones was here and I was like, no, he's a dark vest. And then we just saw him. Is his hair still blonde? Yes. <laughs> What's your favorite thing you've seen here? Matt Jones? Cam Zinc. Cam Zinc? Wow. I'd like to see Cam Zinc, I'm not gonna lie. What about yourself? Seth. Seth. Bird Beak. Seth, but who's that? 
What's your favorite thing you've seen at Sea Otter so far? Uh, I honestly, I think uh, you and <laughs> Paul Bass because it's oh, just bye. really cool to yeah. see uh, yeah. other people uh, in similar yeah. situations. I saw Paul Baz just down there a moment ago, and I was like, I still get a little bit like a fanboy around it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, other than that, uh, yeah, no, honestly, just people, friends, yeah. people I uh, used to ride with, and, uh, you know, just... The community at Sea Otter is winning out well, isn't it? Yes, good boy, good boy. That's great. Thanks, Dante. Yeah, of course. Good to meet you, dude. Any, any particular product or bike you liked? Particular. Oh, I don't really know. Maybe uh, Yeti's new bike. It's old with the 160. Yeah. Me and my dad were looking at it, and yeah. it was really interesting. So, yeah. That was, that was yeah. What's the best tech you've seen at Sea Otter this year? A boring answer coming up. <laughs> the best tech. Like bike tech, you mean? Bike tech. This is where you have to say bowhead, dude. This is where you have to say it. Technology has come so far. So yeah, bowhead, 100%. I actually agree. <laughs> What's your favorite thing you've seen here? Uh, seeing all the people, you know, yeah. everything. Everyone's very friendly and seeing all the, the vendors, pretty nice. Besides you. Um... <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate that. <laughs> uh, like you said, all the people, they're, everyone's so generous. Everyone just giving tips and tricks, and that's what I like about this this hobby, this this sport. You know, you're not the first guys to say that today. The community at Sea Otter is winning out. Quite good. Love it. Did you agree? Were you here? Did you see something else? Or were you not here, and you're just so opinionated you think you know better? If you do, let us know in the comment section down below, because they're all valid points, let's face it. Let us know what you think has been the best tech of this event, or maybe 2023. Um, give us a subscribe on GMBN. And uh, until next time, I will say goodbye.